very good morning students welcome to artificial intelligence class okay we are discussing unit 5 learning concepts okay so in previous videos so we completed these topics okay learning from observations inductive learning decision trees explanation based learning and uh, all these four topics completed and statistical learning we will discuss later and coming to the next one reinforcement learning okay reinforcement learning okay now reinforcement learning so please subscribe channel the basic idea of the reinforcement learning is okay see here a teacher okay a teacher gives knowledge to the student this is not reinforcement learn okay right so what is reinforcement learn okay this is <coughs> now student getting knowledge by self and going to the exam okay the results are fail the fail is the reward the fail is the reward okay so after that okay so after analyzing after analyzing what is the problem what are the mistakes done by me then you will get more knowledge by analyzing that results and go to the exam and next time you will pass that is the reward okay so this is called reinforcement learning okay so self based on the reward you are learning that is reinforcement okay coming to the example chess chess playing okay all of you know about chess game so if you are playing the chess with your friend for the first time you lost the game or oh, then you are very upset about that okay after analyzing the results of the game okay so here after thinking the problems you are playing the second time with the friend you lost once again you are upset so after thinking the first game and the second game you are playing the third time with the friend you won the game okay let's make party okay that is learning so based on the rewards based on the rewards first you lost the game and second you lost the game and finally you won the game so based on the rewards based on the rewards you are learning you are learning that is reinforcement learning okay so this is here this is the rewards rewards are introduced in markov decision process for best policies best steps optimal policies okay what is the task of re reinforcement learning is observe the rewards observe the rewards and learn optimal policy and learn the optimal policy that is reinforcement learning so coming to the designs coming to the designs so agent designs are three types okay utility, utility based agents queue learning agents reflex agents okay so coming to the first one utility based agents okay what is mean by utility based see here you are selecting the actions you are selecting the actions to maximize the utility usage to maximize the usage you are selecting the actions that is best actions okay so example root finding see here root finding okay so first step in the first step one is 100 kilometers okay so under root is 80 kilometers 
So what you will choose? The second one, 80 kilometers will choose. And the second point is, this 100 kilometer road is not safe. Not safe. Okay. Uh, sorry, this 80 kilometer road is not safe. This 100 kilometer road is safe. I mean good road. Okay, what you will choose? 100 kilometers. So, first you are checking the distance and then you are checking the safety, comfort. Okay, so that is utility based agent. Okay, right. Next, second type of agent is Q learning agent. Here, you are choosing the best action based on the current state. Suppose you are moving in this direction. You will have to go left or right. Okay. So, suppose the left side, the traffic is very high. What you will choose? You will take right turn to the destination. Okay. So, that is one example of Q learning. Next, coming to the last one, reflex agents. Reflex agent means it is from state to actions. Direct map, state to action. Present, what is the state? What is the action? Next, what is the state 2? What is the action? Next, what is the state 3? What is the action? So, it directly maps what is the state, what is the action we have to do. Best example, vacuum cleaner. If A is clean, B is dirty, vacuum cleaner, turn right. If B is clean, A is dirty, vacuum cleaner, turn left. Okay, which is already discussed in first unit. Right. Finally, what is reinforcement learning? We are giving input data. An agent will select an algorithm for taking the best action. If the reward is not good, it is bad. So, the state is not changed. So, the agent will select this one more algorithm for best action. If the reward is good, that is the reinforcement. Okay? Right. Now, what are the components? What are the components of the Reinforcement learning agents, RL agents. So, policy, value, model. Three components are there. Coming to the policy. Okay. Policy is nothing but it is behavior function. Agent behavior function from state to actions. What is the state and what is the action performed by the agent? That is the policy. Okay. Next, second one is value. So, value is nothing but, see here, prediction of the future reward. So, by evaluating good or bad, if I do action 1, okay, if I perform action 1, what is the reward? It is it good or bad? If it is good, then it I will apply action 1. If it is bad, then, then I will apply action 2, like that. Okay, coming to the third one, moral. So, moral nothing but, predicts what the environment will do next. Suppose if the state 1, I am applying action 1. After applying action 1, what is the next state of the environment? Okay. So, after applying action 2, okay, the agent will predict the next state after applying the actions. That is the modern. Okay. So, that is the components. Now, coming to the types of the RL agents that means reinforcement learning agents. So, here passive learning is there, active learning is there. Passive learning means, okay, so here agent policy is fixed, no change, only one policy is there. So, here the agent will learn utilities, learn the models. So, best example for that is students. So, you are listening videos, you are reading books. Okay, you are uh, listening lectures like that. You are seeing the uh, chart images like that. You are just listening, listening, seeing. So, you are not involving. You are not involving, actively involving. That is called passive learning. Coming to the active learning, active learning means agent will learn what to do. Exploration. Here, you are getting some experience. That means, best example is you are doing lab, you are doing project works like that. That is active learning. Okay, right. So, in the next sessions, we will discuss passive learning, active learning in clear manner. Now, coming to the uh, closing part. So, <coughs> that is reinforcement learning introduction. In the next session, we will discuss passive learning and then active learning. Thank you. <laughs>